Okay, we've got a little problem here with the rotor head and it's called phase angle procession. Basically, it doesn't matter how many blades you got, there is a relationship between the blade grip and the follower arm. The blade grip to the ball on the swash on the by the follower arm should be at 90 degrees, 90 this way, 90 and forward. What we have, when the blade is straight out the side here, when you apply aileron, this blade shouldn't move, only the other two should move. But because this ball is not aligned with this linkage, when I apply aileron, It's moving and you might think oh yeah big deal but it shouldn't move it should be if I bring the ball around in line like this now when I apply aileron stick you'll notice it doesn't move that's what it should be doing at this position 90 degrees out the same relationship also applies on the elevator. And if I bring the elevator, the rotor in line with that elevator linkage, when I apply elevator, this back blade should not move, but it does, going up and down, rolling around. Now, if I put that link at 90 degrees, which is about there, and I apply elevator, all of a sudden you'll see it's not moving anymore. But the point is, it's that far out of alignment. What this means is the rotor head gets mixed commands. When you apply elevator, it's also putting on aileron. And when you're putting on aileron, it's also putting on elevator. So the helicopter doesn't move like it's supposed to. And this is why it's touchy to fly. Basically, this follower arm needs to be on the other side of this pin. At this position here, This ball should be lining up with that ball. Doesn't look like much, but it's enough to just to bugger up the whole flight control thing. 